smoking kills this slogan is memorable all of us have grown up listening to it but let's forget the health part here for just a second and focus on this part right here flicking the cigarette butt is a widespread and an unnoticed practice people often consider it as a biodegradable substance but cigarette butts are actually the most abundant form of plastic waste in the world with about 4.5 trillion individual butts polluting our global environment in our country around 120 million people smoke every day and on average these smokers smoke about 6.8 cigarettes every day thus producing 816 million cigarette butt waste every single day this number is not just lethal from a health perspective but it's also deadly from an ecological perspective these cigarette butts are made out of hundreds or thousands of tiny plastic microfibers and once they end up in the environment they can stay there for years when these toxic plastics are improperly disposed of the street corner or the car window this slowly leads toxins into our natural systems presenting a serious threat to us our environment and our ecosystem so what is being done about it there are a few startups and projects that are trying to mitigate this problem for example code effort processes everything left after a cigarette has been smoked to make a wide range of products such as cushions and soft toys but even these limited efforts have their challenges the production materials still cost a lot of energy in conversion and reformation and sales of these kinds are challenging these factors hold back the progress and keep it a small scale effort Another obstacle they face is the products manufactured by these companies ultimately utilize plastic and other non-biodegradable materials. This doesn't solve the problem as it makes pollution worse by increasing the object's size and leads to the same end result that we are trying to avoid. To tackle these challenges and remove the waste entirely from this pollution cycle, we here at Enactus SRM have come up with the project Restop. Are recycle cigarette butts in a biodegradable way instead of making consumable goods that ultimately end up in the same dump yard we wanted to create a permanent solution to the problem so we decided to recycle cigarette butts into bricks so how do we do this a research paper published in september 2020 by abbas mohajerani et al at rmit university melbourne details a procedure to inculcate cigarette butts in clay bricks This paper also talks about the extensive benefits of combining these two materials together. We will begin the process by collecting an ample amount of cigarette butts. For this, we have designed a special dustbin. The dustbin will be placed in hotspots across the city. We will contract shopkeepers to ensure that all cigarette butts are disposed of in the designated dustbin. A second approach will include training corporate sanitation workers to collect and segregate cigarette butts from the dustbin and the roads. After collecting ample amounts of discarded cigarette butts, the first step would be to sterilize them. We will be using naphthalene balls in sealed bags to provide a two-for-one cleansing by both sterilizing and deodorizing cigarette butts. Once purged of bacteria and smell, these cigarette butts can be incorporated into the clay brick making process in a number of different ways. All methods such as the butts we added during the blending stage, when water is added to brick clay soil and the other add- additives are mixed together. Once the butts are blended in, the brick firing process and proceed as usual. This innovative method of brick production using cigarette butts makes bricks a more environmentally friendly product because it leads to decreased dump cigarette butts and reduces the energy used during the brick production process. Also, less clay is used thereby reducing the stress on the environment of soil regeneration. Cigarette butts are voluminous hence reducing the raw material cost for clay brick manufacturers. Bricks made with cigarette butts are also lighter and provide better insulation, meaning reduced household heating and cooling cost. If just 2.5% of all the bricks produced annually worldwide included 1% of cigarette butt content, all of the cigarette butts could be recycled. And it is estimated that the global firing energy consumption could be reduced by 20 billion megajoules. This approximately equates to 1.74 times the power consumed by Delhi NCR every year. Alongside this cigarette butt collection process, we will also be running an anti-tobacco campaign to encourage and support people to quit tobacco and cigarette smoking. For this project, we have also collaborated with Wasted India for their expertise in waste management solutions. They take an active interest in providing and executing 360 waste solutions. In the end, just another reminder that smoking kills Not only you, your future generations too.